good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night, depending on where you're located. As always, welcome. Today we're going to be doing a, what should be a quick little video, hopefully, installing a new thing in my 2021 Ford Bronco Sport Badlands. One of the things that's unique about the Bronco Sport Badlands, as compared to any of the other models, is that it has an under-seat storage compartment in the back. So the back passenger side seat opens up, which I will show you in a second, and you can there's a storage compartment underneath there. For that storage compartment, Ford actually sells through the deal, you can order one with this, a vault or a safe so that you can store valuables or whatnot while you are out hiking or adventuring or doing whatever you want to do. It's a factory option, you can order it with the vehicle. I managed to order one directly from the manufacturer, that is a company called Council Vault. Let's get started with opening it up. All right, you get a instruction manual, uh, a few bolts, and then you have, oh, it's heavy, <laughs> the actual safe itself. actually quite heavy, which you would want it to be, right? So, to be removed by end user only, do not remove. Combination has been preset from the factory to zero, 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 zero. All right. All right, it's a little stiff of the cardboard in there. But there it is. So here is the safe, a nice little Ford emblem on it. It's got a nice little padded bottle. Not a ton of space in here. I mean, what are you going to expect out of such a small space? This should be plenty of space to hold things like your wallet, your phone. I also intend to use it for another item that is good to keep secured when it's not going to be on your person. Something that I think that YouTube doesn't really like all the time, so I'm not even going to go there. But y'all know what I'm talking about. That'll fit in here. All right, let's check out these instructions. So there's two different sets here. Let's see the main one, install steps. Review all steps before initiating install, okay. All right, well now that I've reviewed the instructions, let's go over to the install. All right, now we're inside the Bronco. All you're gonna need for the install is a 3 8 inch drive socket and ratchet. As I said earlier, the underseat compartment is only available on this model, the Badlands trim, it is on no other model. So don't go looking for this storage compartment if you own a base, big bend, or outer banks package. The opening for it, there's a button right here. You push that and up it goes. You got your space. Instructions say to remove the liner. Take your bolt. You open this up to find these screw holes. To bolt this down, we have four self tapping bolts. The short ones go in the front. are kind of awkward to install and there should be two inside here's one stud it in as much as you can which ain't much the other one's way back in deep down inside here there we go finally got that that was a bit awkward take your take your ratchet I'm not going to lie to you, I did cheat a little bit. Directions do not recommend doing this. Actually, they don't say anything about it. But the directions do say to use a ratchet. However, for the longer bolts, it takes absolutely forever. I gave up on it. 
busted the power tools out. All right, and there it is installed. Let's turn the dial, opens right on up. Get all that space, there's a bunch of space down here. Give you an idea, the socket. It's pretty, pretty deep to the side. Not so deep that way. But yeah, it's a pretty good size storage compartment. Nice and tucked away underneath the seat. All right, well, that's the install of our under seat safe in the back of my Bronco. I hope this video was helpful. Honestly, the process was very easy. The dealership quoted me $430 just for the safe itself. And I was able to purchase mine for under $330, so more than $100 cheaper directly from the manufacturer. I don't know what they would have charged to install it, but I'm going to guess that a fully installed rear seat safe from Ford was probably going to cost somewhere in the $500 plus dollar range. So you can save yourself a couple hundred dollars by buying it directly and installing it yourself. With that being said, I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to fill this safe up with something interesting. And yeah, I'll catch you guys all in another video. Take care.